When Palmer first arrived at Stamford Bridge, there were questions whether he would earn any more game time than he did at the Etihad. Manchester City have gained a reputation for developing and ruthlessly selling off their academy products, an approach that has yielded £260 million in six years. Cole Palmer was the latest graduate to be deemed expendable in the summer. Considering he just made his first Premier League start for the Blues against Fulham in early October, Palmer has adjusted quickly to West London, a surprising feat considering he has spent his whole career progressing through the Etihad youth levels. In the early stages of his Chelsea career, he has made the £42.5 million transfer fees appear like an excellent deal. Palmer's debut has been so strong that he may already be the ownership's most exquisite signing to date. Few players have had the same effect or shown the same consistency as Palmer in barely over three months at the club. He is known for his ball-carrying ability, elegant dribbling, and ball retention in tight areas. He is also known for his speed, agility, and quickness, which he uses to evade defenders. Palmer likes to cut inside and shoot from distance, and his shot technique is excellent. He is comfortable playing long balls and playing the ball off the ground often. Palmer has a sublime quality finesse shot, which seems to be able to locate the far-right transition at will. Here are five mind-blowing facts you need to know about Cole Palmer. 1. Elite Mentality Palmer ended a 15-year relationship with Manchester City by joining Chelsea on deadline day, but taking that enormous leap of faith in his own abilities certainly didn't bother him. He exudes confidence and has slotted in perfectly, even having the bravery to take a penalty against Arsenal ahead of grizzled veteran Raheem Sterling. Despite his age and the fact he was working with arguably the greatest coach of all time, Palmer was steadfast in his belief that he was ready to be a regular starter in the Premier League rather than a bit-part player in Pep Guardiola's ever-rotating winning machine, and he backed himself. Ironically, he would have honed that strong-mindedness at City. I'm not saying I shied away from the competition because I've never done that, the 21-year-old explained. I'd been around the first team for a few years and wanted more opportunities to play, in my position, and have a bigger impact. It was a crucial option. I'm not aware of anything else. I've never been on loan. I've never lived anywhere other than Manchester. 2. Versatility on the field Predominantly an unshackled creative midfielder, Palmer is also able to play in a variety of attacking positions. While many players specialize in one position, Cole Palmer is known for his adaptability on the field. Primarily an attacking midfielder, Palmer has showcased his skills in various positions, including as a forward and even on the wings. This versatility not only makes him a valuable asset to his team, but also adds an element of unpredictability to his gameplay. His uncanny ability to get past opposing players has led to him being used as a right winger for Manchester City's junior teams, while an incredible scoring streak has made him a good alternative up front. A versatility from midfield that was so important for Pep Guardiola's side last season. His standout technical prowess comes as a bit of a surprise when you first lay eyes upon him. Rather gangly in stature and standing at 6 2 inch, he can also add an aerial threat in advanced positions. 3. Creative Force Nkunku's injury in early August saw Chelsea lose their would-be creator-in-chief before the season had even begun, and they obviously began looking for a successor behind the scenes. Despite the fact that Nkunku had not played a competitive game for the Blues, it was deemed impossible to compensate for the goals and assists he would have supplied considering his RB Leipzig return of 126 contributions in 172 matches. Palmer, though, has been unfazed, going about his work with the kind of quality and determination that belies his tender age. Always looking to probe and create, he was averaging more progressive passes than any other player in the Premier League at the start of November, and continues to lead the division in passes into the penalty area. While it's clear that he's one of those players whose contributions aren't always represented in statistics, as he stays back and attempts to be the catalyst, he does have four assists and four penalty goals already. 
four, he is a baller. Palmer has reintroduced a quality that cannot be explained that has perhaps been lacking since the days of Eden Hazard, since becoming an essential element of the team. In a nutshell, his balletic ball-carrying, skill, and confidence are delightful to watch, especially considering Chelsea's recent preference to lean towards direct, utilitarian attacking players like Sterling and Timo Werner. Kai Havertz is an exception, but he too became tactical as he was forced to fit into a squad that he never completely fit. Consistency is another thing those costly signings have never been able to deliver, but Palmer is currently hitting the same high-level game in, game out, and sometimes he doesn't even look like he's trying. He has already endeared himself to the Chelsea faithful with his sumptuous technical ability, and if he can maintain this standard, he will make a name for himself at Stamford Bridge. 5. He chose City over United. Palmer had two of the country's major clubs vying for him in 2010 as a result of his outstanding early performances. Despite lacking a natural explosive pace that usually draws giants to raw talent, Manchester United was also interested in the midfielder. Palmer and his family were eventually persuaded by City's display and joined the program at the under-8 level. Pep Guardiola is also a great fan. Guardiola underlined his determination to use the plethora of youthful talent at his disposal in the club's junior teams during an injury-plagued spell for City last season. Following his team's 2-1 victory over Bournemouth in Round 3 of the League U Cup, the City boss told the club website, We have Cole Palmer, who will be an exceptional player. He then gave him 90 minutes in their 3-0 win over Burnley in the following round. That full debut was followed by a cameo in City's 3-0 Champions League group stage victory over Marseille a month later, before a third appearance for the senior side in the community shield. In conclusion, in the wake of that superb performance at Stamford Bridge, Palmer received the biggest honor of his career to date, a senior England call-up. With Gareth Southgate dealing with an extensive number of injuries with Jude Bellingham, a huge question, he looked to the informed Chelsea midfielder to reinforce his team. While he's unlikely to earn any minutes, Southgate is renowned for taking his time integrating newcomers into the starting 11. If he maintains his present form, he may slip into Euro 2024 candidacy. Palmer's path is worth following. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe for more content, and let us know in the comments who you'd like us to cover next. Until next one, please stay tuned.